In a lot of ways, this island is the key to some of the big secrets and what ifs of 20th century history. Wartime scientists carefully packaged their weaponized anthrax and headed 600 miles north. The ambition was to develop a frightening new weapon, an anthrax bomb. Anthrax is a naturally occurring but deadly organism, and any outbreak can have fatal consequences. A few little explosions going off. But just on this near part of the island, on this side, there were several of them, and there were little sort of puffs in the air. What on earth is it? What are they doing there? I actually saw it with my own eyes. A big horse jumped in this hole with the legs. Rigor mortis had set in, so that the, I remember having to cut, they cut the legs off the horse. And then telling the adults about the, the, all these sheep lying in the fields, with their legs in the air, and they're all dead. Government officials promptly paid compensation to crofters and persuaded them that the anthrax infection had come ashore when a carcass was dumped from a passing Greek ship. This was found behind a locked door. Somebody had somehow managed to get in to that door during normal operational hours of the tower. Two packages in five days meant that this was a campaign. But the mysterious group wrong-footed the authorities when it was discovered that the second package placed in the Blackpool Tower was actually harmless, uninfected soil. It was a close-knit community, and, and they, they didn't want to say anything sometimes in case they said too much. I felt that there was maybe more known in the community than was being said. The police weren't even allowed to go to Grunyard and inspect the scene of the crime. But one person who was authorised to visit the island was boatman Stuart Flett. In his diary, he recorded an important breakthrough. Police probe new clue in Grenier. The raiders had used his boat. It was chained to a tree in the winter time. Chain was broken, and a note saying, "Sorry about the chain. Thanks for the use of the boat. Dark harvest." As the end of 1981 approached. It seemed everyone was aware of the poisoned island of Grunyard. Dark Harvest put that story front and center. They succeeded in putting the spotlight on what was, when you think about it, an absolute scandal. 